press the action button. Two hours later. Oh, hey, with the lines and clap, I could use a few extra hands. That's a genius idea. I should. What do you think? You really think that's a good idea? This is great. I, uh, I sh Really? <sighs> that's the stuff. Man, I really got nothing better to do. Something's wrong here. What's going on? That is a brilliant idea. So, I definitely should. But before I do... <laughs> I guess I better get up. So, um, hmm. From me. I'm full of toxic alkaloids, but I'm getting kind of sweaty and- I really think that I should? Should I? Lord, let's go home. Yeah, I think I will play some video games today that is not on the Switch. I know. Uh, get in here. So you really think I should play a video game? It's post-it notes. It's not. <laughs> what? You know, for the Nintendo Switch. But what game could I play? Who am I? Why are you looking at the camera? You gotta take all these thoughts and just vomit them out onto some sticky notes. Oh, let's do it. Starting off obvious, your brain is like a computer. Too much data and it begins to slow down in processing new information. Oh, sounds like my type of fun. Get, get on my shoulder, Gingy. Two hours later. Come on, Pale. You the Pale. Let's do this. But probably, if it can break down rust, it can break down food. Get up there. I, I, I don't know about that. Gaining too much weight drinking? Are you sad? Huh. Us too. Drink 7-Up. Yeah, whatever. Let's do this. <clears throat> Am, can I get... Them? No. Ow! I me to sit. No. Ow! Mm -mm. I me to sit. My word. Please? No. Papaya. No. Sesame salad seed with cherries on top. No. Sprinkly sprinkle sprinkle. No. Salamander. No. Pikachu. No. Yoshi. No. Max. No. Maximilian. No. Max Fox of Plenty. No, you're close. JK, you're not. Jack in the box? No. Yeah. Through. Well, it's not allowed to work. Get you! I should be allowed to sit. Yeah, he's not allowed to sit for work. Okay, it's that. Boogala boogala foo foo. I don't know what it's like. Kana fani chi poku tu. 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 Tu.
Pacachi. I can never remember that part. Maybe here. Lobo Tati Kibau. No, no. But it's Lobo Tau something. <coughs> Is this chanting ever going to work? What is it going to take to get into contact with a powerful juju spirit from another world? Hi. I'm eating some fries. Hey! It worked! Uh, hello? Can you hear me? Why, yes. Um, I can hear you. Hi. You do not speak, but I see that you listen. How dare you. I can clearly speak. Are you just not listening? You look so strange. Say that to your big nose, sir. Your clothes. That is insulting. The power stick you hold in your hand. Um, this is actually a PlayStation remote, but hey, we, we could go with that. I mean, yeah, we could we, we close. Wall. Oh, wait. Wall. Th 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 there we go. I think I broke it. Oh no, I broke it! What have I done? Oh, I know I fixed it. Okay, I'm, I'm good. I'm, I'm, I'm good. So, are you... Am I controlling you? Or are you controlling me? I have never seen a juju like you before! Huh, well, I'm not a juju. What type of religion is that? Is that a is that religion? Hey, hey, Google. Well, what type of mess is juju? Here's the definition of juju: a style of music popular among the Yoruba in Nigeria and characterized by the use of guitars and variable pitch drums. Hmm. Juju. We we can go with that. Really? What is this magic box you watch me on? This, my good sir, is called a TV. Um, you see, we humans use this to watch magical TV shows, like Spongebob. Imagination. It is clearly the most important thing in your heart. Whoa, you're way too close, dude. Um, could, could you please back up? Please. P please. You're, you're scaring me. And I think you're scaring the children. You do me great honor to watch me on it. Well, that's the first time someone said I was honoring them involving watching them on a TV screen. I feel honored that you feel honored that I feel honored. That you feel honored that I'm honored that I'm honored that you're honored. My name is Jabalba. Ha, I'm Pearl. Actually, no, I'm actually... Dolly, I, I go by Journey Tech on my YouTube channel. Nice to meet you, Jabalba. You, you you know you got a big nose and you're bald, right? Could you be the ancestor to Mr. Cri Mr. Clean? If so, can I get your autograph? I am the powerful shaman of the great and legendary Pupanuno people. Heh <laughs> heh, toilet humor. So, did you poop a Nunu, not Nunu, know that uh, your name sounds stupid? <laughs> For generations we have. Hey! Hey, quiet out there! I'm talking to a Juju! Not Juju. Tech, would you shut those people up? Weren't you a basket of roses? This is important! And get Warrior Lock! I want to introduce him to this juju here! You do not listen, do you? Oh well. I tried. I am so sorry, oh strange and powerful juju. Wait, are you apologizing because you keep calling me juju? Or, no, I mean a juju. Or are you just apologizing because Tack is standing outside the door staring at us? I don't think he can help it. You're pretty weird, Jabulba. Pretty, pretty weird. There's a lot going on today. A 
that's why I've called upon you for your help. Let me explain. <clears throat> Throughout the history of the Kupanunu people, shaman like myself had known that someday something terrible would happen to our great protector, the Moon Juju. So said the Pupanunu people's prophecy. Hmm, this Pepsi tastes like a prophecy. Oh, something bad's gonna hap happen to the Pupanunu people's Moon Juju. Hmm, what if I keep drinking this will happen? And an evil, evil villain's gonna come up. Hmm. And stupid comic relief side character people are going to be fighting alongside the bad guy. They'll remind people of the Hercules movies because of pain and panic when they're gonna be called pins and needles. Hmm. This Pepsi stuff really works. Drink some now and you'll you'll get some prophecies going on, man. Poop a new new. Poop a new new. Drink the poop a new new juice. The moon juju is our shield against evil and the source of my juju power. She is strong and nice and oh, so beautiful. If I didn't know any better, I would think that you were crushing on the moon, Juju. But, wait, hold on, what, what's your name again? Uh, Jabold and Moon Juju sitting in a tree. K-I-S-S-I-N-G. Wait a second, so is she older than you or are you older than her? Because technically, she's a moon Juju, so she's some weird mystical person that has lived thousands of years. Well, you didn't exactly say that. So for all we know, she could be in her thousands, or she could be 34. Hmm. We do not know. We'll find out eventually. Eh. Oh, that's Tlaylock. He's not nice, and he's sure not beautiful. Ah, uh, the, the magic hologram thingy can hear you. You saw it. it looked at you when you said it wasn't pretty. So wait, wait. Is it one of those things where uh, you're talking into the magical whatever and, and the actual guy can hear you? Or is it one of those things where, like, it's a hologram? Questions, questions, questions. Anyway, let's go, 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 go continue with the story. He's jealous and practices bad juju. At the council that chose the new High Shaman, he was passed over in favor of me. I mean, yeah, sure. Pick between good, pick between evil. Hmm. Should I go with the nice guy or the one that looks like he'd probably murder me in, in my sleep with that bone that he's wearing on his head? So yeah, I think I'll go with, with the good guy. I can understand. So last night, Tlaylock decided to take his revenge. Tlaylock crept into the temple of the moon with his foul servants, pins and needles, and stole the moonstones, the source of the moon juju's power. If you don't mind my asking, um, so what's the moon juju's power? Is she like, she like, has some magical protection thing that can, uh, that can, like, protect the whole of the Poopanunu people? Or is this one of those things where we're never going to know the answer no matter what we do? Hmm, maybe the TV series has some answers. I'm not... Wait, maybe. I was going to say, I'm not going to watch that show, but then again. Might happen, I don't know. That show sounds like garbage. Anyways, continue. The first thing Tlaylock did was to use the Moonstones to change the Poopanunu people into stupid, healthy sheep. I actually like sheep, sir. Although, yeah, they are pretty stupid. 
Without the moon juju, my power was only enough to protect a few. And this is only the beginning of Blaylock's <laughs> terrible plan. How do you know so much about Treylock's plan? It's almost like you're working with them. Hmm, nah. That's giving you too much credit. You probably just called upon me because you were too lazy to figure out a way to defeat him yourself, so you just called upon me basically just to be like, hey, can you help me? Because I'm too lazy to do it. Hmm, you should really try helping Jabola. But what are you doing? But Treylock is a fool. Way to go, insulting the dude that can turn everybody into wild, stinky animals. Way to go, Jabola. Way to go. He won't get away with it. For the Poopanunu people's prophecy <laughs> clearly says, a mighty warrior trained by the High Shaman will defeat Tleilak and save the Moon Juju. I have trained such a warrior. His name is Lak. Tech. What are you doing? You told me to go get Locke. Yes, that's right. Go fetch Locke. Stop playing with the sheep. I did get Locke. You, know. you fetched a dirty, stinky animal. That's Locke. See? He's wearing Locke's amulet. Tulay Locke must have changed him into a sheep. No, 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 no. No, no, this is all wrong. This isn't in the... the poop, 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 the mighty warrior doesn't lick my foot. Stop the licking, Lark! You. Oh, this is terrible. Can't we just change him back? <clears throat> I don't know. Yes, I've got it! We can change Lark back into a mighty warrior! That, my good sir, is called stealing ideas, and you shouldn't do it. You know that that was tax idea. This great juju spirit who watches us from another world can help. <coughs> Follow Tech. Protect him with your power. Go with Tech to the ancient burial ground of our ancestors and put the teeth into the statues. Can I use my brush as like a staff because I don't got no powers, but I, I can pretend that this brush is my, uh, my, uh, staff. I could probably smack things or people upside the head with it. I'm sure that could be a great power, a great help. And get me some magical lubu plants while you're out. Now go! Both of you! Hey, you can't tell me what to do. I thought you were honored that I came here. Mr. Oh, oh, I, oh you're some magical spirit and I'm gonna talk to you all nice and stuff. Yeah, now, now where's your respect? You were only excited for the first few seconds. See my magical power stick I got in my hand? Don't be surprised if I smack you upside the head with it for talking to me so disrespectfully, Mr. Mr. Bald Man, Mr. Clean Wannabe. I see you. Better stop yelling at me, sir. Lock must stop Tlay Lock before he destroys the Moon Goddess! Well, that I said, can you give me some magical lube? I'm like, oh. <clears throat> well, yeah. I'm for a question, nothing, but I'm goofy questioning. Yeah. This is, I remember watching this for the first time and being amazed. Hello, Tack. My name's Flora. The Moon Juju sent me here to hang out with you and help you whenever I can. Well, it's a long road ahead. We better get started. Would you like to do the honors to start? Mr. Sister? Oh, okay, you are looking. Yes. Surely not. That is why I wanted to be here. He's done another magic password, so. Hello! Okay, Do I love to use a magic password? No, it's the N word. What? <laughs> okay. It's, okay. Oh my god, I am not. Hello. <laughs> You seem smart enough to figure this out on your own, but you move yourself around by using the move stick, and if you need to jump, it's as simple as pressing the jump button. You can press the jump button twice to perform a double jump. I don't laugh. I like to think of myself as thorough. I need no sense, but okay. 
when she was saying don't laugh, I'm being thorough, she was meaning because it's kind of silly to explain something that's so obvious to somebody. And now I'm explaining something that's so obvious to you guys out of comic relief. Da 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 Oh, I just thought of something else important to tell you. Sometimes you'll notice that the camera's not facing the same direction you want to go. You can use the camera stick to rotate the camera around yourself. If the camera isn't looking in the direction you want, just use the camera stick to rotate it until you see what you need to see. Rotate Bruh, the camera now like it needs. This is the torture. This is the tutorial. This is the tutorial mode. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, so. You can't skip it. If you could, I would. If I could. That's what I'm doing. Great. Now you can do this anytime you need to look at something. Simple enough. Oh, and if you just want the camera to center behind you, it's as easy as pressing the camera stick. <sighs> now something I want to point out, Mr. District, is, um... Yeah, what's the point anymore? Yeah, I, uh, sorry. We'll still call you Mr. District. Um, is... How nice. What? Oh, it's big stuff. <laughs> um, bless you. Um, we have Scooby, or well, yeah, that, that's that's yeah, cool. Scooby. Yeah, we have Scooby with us too. Say say hi, Scooby. Okay, Jack. Hello. And I think you'll find <laughs> most animals to be helpful in some way or another. If you come across an animal, you should experiment with it to learn how it can help you. Some animals can even be ridden. Oh, yes, the mighty rhino. These fellows are great for breaking things into little tiny pieces. Go ahead and jump on board. If you want him to speed up, try giving him a swat with your club. Don't you love how animated she is? She's just like, whatever she tells you, she acts it out. When I was a kid, I, she, I loved her. Like, I thought she was the coolest character. <coughs> That's it, slave. So are you finding it fun so far? Yeah. Yeah, it's gonna get more fun as you go along. Especially when you get into the chicken suit. What? Yeah, exactly. Oh yeah, and your feather is a- well, you might as well let her play it. Graphics too, man. Well, it's just the same on the PS2. Yeah, it's definitely PS2 graphics. Yeah, Wait, what is, isn't this a PS2? Yeah, this is a PS2. Now, while you're adventuring, you'll no doubt discover you can pick up certain items. What's cool is that you can throw any item you pick up by just using the action button. If you're tired of carrying an object around and just want to set it down, press the use button. Now, the cool thing about this GameCube is uh, I actually grew up with the GameCube version of this. It's the same exact game, just GameCube. That's it. So the buttons are oh, okay. I love fighting plants in this game, even though I also hate it because it's super annoying. <laughs> so you, you run across it. There you go. Now you press uh, square to throw. But you gotta throw it at those little flat things. You really don't have to if you don't want to. Can skip this actually. Bruh. There you go. Why are you looking at my bed, Scooby? You, you know you can just skip this. Yeah. I okay, do. see the platform right there? I do realize that. But like... You just you want. Yeah, when I first played it, I was Actually, every time I played this as a kid, I always broke the platform. Even if I didn't need to. And you're gonna love the skeleton character in this game. Oh, I love all different types of skeleton characters. My favorite! Ah, skeleton! The fire's a skeleton! So, is he, is he in the TV show? What? Is he in the TV show of Ooh. Black? The skeleton character? Um, I don't remember Skeleton character. I thought you were talking about Sam, and like, huh? No. 4K? No, I'm talking about Cat. Kobe Bryant! Anyway. 
Okay. <coughs> well, yeah, I have a control. Now you have to jump onto that ledge. Sometimes when you jump, you'll grab onto a ledge. If you're holding something when you grab a ledge, you'll always drop that item. You'll also drop it if you fall off tall ledges. Very tall. I love how she didn't help me. She's like, you oh, see this yeah. little guy? He's a loop tail monkey, and quite mischievous, I might add. Monkeys like this one love throwing coconuts at other animals. Yeah, and you. We're an animal, darling. You realize that? Yeah. Where is, where is the dude? Oh, animal. I see him. Hey, Tad, try throwing the melon at the monkey to see what happens. Ha <laughs> ha, animal abuse. Ha ah, ha radical, dude. Ah. Here you can suck it, dude. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you voicing the one face from SpongeBob? You gotta face the monkey dad. That's what I'm trying to do. We should draw the pretty stupid. Just like your dad. Huh? <laughs> Take that, stupid. Ah. Yeah, you did it. Do you notice that if you toss something at him, he'll toss a coconut at whoever's closest to him? Keep this in mind while you're adventuring. Okay. I wouldn't do that. Why not? I'm gonna pop the No, I'm not. You can't jump over there. Watch me. Watch okay. me. Watch me. You're not allowed to. <laughs> Says who? Your mom. <coughs> My mom! Let me kill the chicken. Let me kill the chicken. You can't kill the chicken in the Why can I? You can beat it. Yes! <laughs> yes! Yeah, you can do that. But they never die. Oh, uh, unless, of course. Kill. Unless, of course, you come off yet. Uh, okay. Oh my god! Legend of Zelda be like, nope. How do I pick him up? You can't. You, can't, you gotta hit him off the edge. <laughs> oh, fun. Of course, you can't do it here because it's blocked. <laughs> but you'll be able to do it later. Die! You haven't even got to Die! Even... No, you I just got... want to abuse the animals. You haven't even got to the I want to abuse the animal. <sighs> I swear to god, if it's not a hippopotamus, it's better. <laughs> They look like abominations. You'll like them. Bacteria found in foreskin? Something like that. Feathers are very valuable. Make sure you pick up any feathers you see. To pick up the feathers, just one hook. There are different kinds of feathers you can find. Uh. These yellow feathers are health feathers. See how they look like the feather on the top of your head? That's because Go the feather on your head is also your health meter. When it turns I out just, purple, my brain just you're stopped branded what you were These saying. other feathers also give you health, but, but their primary rich. use is for magic. As you progress, you'll need mana feathers to do magic. Wait, so it's further is health bar? Yeah. That's what I waited for her to tell you. Pretty much. I see your current weapon is the <coughs> It's a little basic, but easy to use. Just press the action button to swing the club. Huh? Practice ah. those breakable jars. Yeah, well, sure SMASH POTS! Yes! Legend of Zelda Hill. Once again with the chicken. Are you sure you don't want to sit fully on the bed? Are you comfortable like that? I'll clearly come down. Ah, 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 Listen to what they sound like. Boom! Shut the lock up! Dude, shut up. I actually want to avoid you. Anyway. Wait, just listen to the bad guys. Those are nerbles, by the way. I'm um, sorry, I don't speak Italian. Huh? Those animals that were attacking you are called nerbles. You don't need any more feathers. You're a thing lot more feathers. Okay. Yeah. I'll put my hand on the Help me, there's a demon attacking me. Where is he? Look at that thing! Looks disgusting. It's like your mother. Oh my god. 
Like the one dinosaur chick. You know what I said? And then, like, that's like, his offspring. Bitch. Oh, it turns purple. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, like a badly designed stitch. There was a funnier thing I was thinking. It was like a neglected stitch or something. Oh, a neglected stitch. Wait, what? I've been at this point reading the word novel. Wait! Wait, you don't want to keep playing? Not really, no. It's a lot of fun though. I hate the show. I hate the show. I mean, the show is pretty bad for Come what here, I Come here, baby! Come here, baby! Yeah! Will you shut my door? <clears throat> no. Please? No. Oh no! <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna turn down the volume just a little bit. Me. So you're not leaving. You can sit here, you know. Ow! So cool. Why would you? Hello, everybody. I'm playing Shaq. My sister is being evil. From the Poopanoodoo people. <laughs> Man, this was my childhood. Ah! Yeah. And also, how did she manage to lose this many lives? The this isn't even the end of the training thing. Okay. Yeah, these, this controller is pretty bad. Why, thank you. Wow! Look at the orangutan bending that banana tree. I wonder what would happen if you stood on a big leaf. You should try it, Jack. Okay, but I'm not gonna like it. Wait a second, guys. Okay. Guess what time it is! Adventure time? It's nom nom time! Nom nom! Uh, orangutan? Nom nom time, baby! Woo! Uh, Listen, Dad, anytime you want to have the orangutan throw you somewhere, just stand Woo! near him and he'll pull down the tree. Mother, hold me. Okay, excuse me! You forgot to throw me! Thank you. Sweet, I did it. Taste me. Okay. I forgot I can There'll treat. Be of places in the world where you have I realize I could be taken in a very sexual way by apologizing for my facing. behavior. So push the moves to um, left or right to line yourself up before um, you jump off. What? I'm drinking a Pepsi. It tastes like Pep and then C. That's what the letter t C tastes like. I'm sorry guys, it's a little hard to work with the PlayStation remote. My GameCube never did this. Maybe I should have just spent the 50 something bucks. Or just get me a better game Thing remote. <laughs> now I can work with this. To screen, I mean to swing, press four. Wait, what? Press square. Why did I say four? Uh. <laughs> Excuse me. Ow, that bird. That's what pep 
Dutsy Dutsy, guys. Hi there, birds. You look very real. Totally not. Totally not animated. <laughs> Anyways, hi everybody. I'm Tack. Very nice to meet you guys. This looks like my hair. Oh, hold on. He has hair. It's... Wait. I don't know. Is, is this his hair? Hold on. I need to get a closer look at him. This could be his hair. I always thought that this was a weird hat he was wearing. I mean, as a kid, I thought it was his hair, but I wonder if it's a hat. Now it's time to learn about rams. See if you can get past that. Yeah, I really don't care for that, but okay. Eh <laughs> <laughs> Way to go, Tack! You're ready to help Jabulba turn Locke and the other villagers back into human form. Jabulba said we needed to go to the burial grounds. We can get there from your village. Let's get started. Okay. Something I want to point out, guys, <clears throat> is this game is a lot of fun. I'm free! Freedom! is Tax Village, home of the Pupanunu people. They're wonderful and really friendly. Too bad most everyone's been turned into a sheep. Hopefully we can help them. I'm sure we can. Hmm. This is fun. Okay, Tack. We need to collect the magical plant so Jabulba can turn Locke back into human form. But first, we need to go to the burial grounds to get the staff. I know the way. Follow me. Tack, I can't be bothered now. Come back when you have the warrior's staff and the plants. This is a door, by the way. See the knob? Tack. I can't be bothered now. Come back when you have the warrior's staff and the plants. Mm hmm Yeah, it's a little hard to play when this remote is constantly not allowing you. You should constantly be looking at this angle. This game would probably be better to play on the Switch. Of course I would. There we go, I made it. You kidding me? No! Okay, we're gonna try it. 
Just again, no shortcutting. This bucket will take us to burial ground. Okay, here we go. Okay, this is working out. This is the burial grounds. All of your ancestors are buried here. Many of them great Pukumunu people. Everyone here is watched over by the great warrior king. It's his tomb we have to enter to get the staff. Okay then. Here we go. I see the statues Mr. Bobo was talking about. We should go over there. Okay. This music. Okay. Okay then. to see you. Yeah. How dare you. Hmm. Which statue should I put it in? Oh, I already got that one. I wasn't paying attention to where the tooth was. There it is. What do you guys think of the music? Where should I go now? I think this one.
Oh, I forgot I can double jump. That's how long it's been, guys. You know it's been a long time when you forgot you could double jump in a game. Nice. Hmm. Definitely the sound I wanted him to make. Wee. Parkouring. Ah, oh, dang it. I miss. Ian, we're almost done. I love how old this game is. It's a very pretty game. There's a pattern I'm going for. I'm going slanted. My childhood. There it is, the last tooth. Rock okay. <laughs> Stitches, ugly cousin. Okay, get the last two. Before I get, get the tooth in there, I don't know, I just really wanted to do that. And here we are. Objective completed. Going in. It's one of my favorite scenes. Here we go. 
Hold it. Ooh, that adds a nice echo to it. Eat. Yeah. Hi, everybody. I got a stick. Can it, can it, got a stick it to me. That looks like one of those plants that Jibulba wants. Okay, prepare to have some Mario Kart things happening. How dare you! How dare you! Feel my stick of doom! I stick you to my stick of doom! Ow. I just remembered why I hate these plants and why you can't just straight up hit them. Okay. You don't steer me. You look like a Sasquatch. Uh. Excuse me. Mario Brothers plant. Oh, you want to spit at me? You? Now that you've defeated the plant, you can get the small plant from his mouth. It's the one we need to take back to Jabulba. Okay, see these big old plants? Yeah, you know how we were fighting them? Or just after its tongue. Look at this. Woo! Nice! You. Could you imagine living in a world where this thing's real? Look, look at its little arms. Okay, on to another one. We have more to fight. Nice. Nice. I love Tech. He's awesome. He's like, not only am I gonna be awesome, no, I'm gonna be super awesome. Die! Nice! Sweet! Sweet! Die. Uh. I died. Not surprising. Until he gets back on here. Nice. <laughs> Take a second to let the fruits go. Oh.
right now there's one left. And we're good. There you go. Thank you for your help, monkey. You've been quite the uh, service. Try me. because uh, I played this a lot as a kid. Okay, over here. No, not over here. It's over here. <coughs> Oh, hold on, before I can wait. No, it's over here. What a ugly tree! Look at that tree! That looks scary. I wouldn't want to be this tree's enemy. Did someone just carved that out of a tree and said, Yeah, let, let's keep it. Let's keep it. This looks great. Okay, so the other plan is on here. I'm compelled to get the feather. Okay. And here goes the last one. gather more feathers because you can continue a fight at any time need feathers I hate you. That's gonna leave a Yeah. 
always compelled to grab the feathers. Okay. So, uh, let's keep going. wondered what we're in okay yeah I do remember freaking like you know fun hope these weren't some relics for the tomb <laughs> to break anything that's breakable. That's a new one. I think I glitched it out of its thing. See, look at that. I don't think I was supposed to do that. Yeah, I don't think I was supposed to pull out two, two nervals. That could have been a glitch right there. I'm making everything in this guy's tomb. The king does not allow you to break the tomb. Too bad I just did it in fact. Yeah. Yeah. Let me hop up all on this tomb. When in doubt, take the stick out. Huh. Gonna leave a mark. Yeah. And here we go. Yeah. Okay, now we're gonna go this way. Okay. Okay, I made it. Okay, we're going up. What's up you guys? So I hope you guys liked this video. I worked hard on the editing and it, it was honestly a lot of fun to make. Um, I will be doing more videos soon. Shout out to Susie and um, welcome to my channel all you newcomers and uh, prepare for some more awesome videos. If there's anything you would like me to make, let me know because I love making videos. Um, yeah, so uh, this was fun. Of course, do some live streams of TAC, not tonight, obviously. But, um, I love you guys. Have a great day, and this was fun. Bye! What's up, guys? I'm Trini Tech. So, for the final thing I wanted to say to end this video is that I do not own Ginger Pale, but he is a character made by uh, a YouTuber called Ginger Pale. You should definitely check out his channel. Um, I used a few of his voice clips on my video. He was never talking in my video. That was just voice clips. But it was all for good fun. It wasn't meant for no profit. I don't make no profit on this channel. But I just wanted to say that I love you guys. Hope you have a great day. And you should go check out Ginger Bale's channel. Yeah.